Aggie STEM has helped prepare our teachers and provide them with methodologies, pedagogies, and strategies to strengthen their preparation of project-based learning activities in order to provide our students with a singular and unique academic experience. Aggie STEM is one of the seven T-STEM centers in the state of Texas. What makes us different is because all of the directors are faculty members, we are basically researchers at heart. So in addition to doing the professional development that all T-STEM centers do, we study how to make professional development more effective, and we study the process of the teachers implementing what they are taught in professional development to see how can we make the implementation more effective for increasing student performance. Aggie STEM has been extremely important for our teachers because it's given them the essential tools to be able to offer the best in education, in technology, engineering, math, and science for our students. Aggie STEM comes in and they give trainings, they work side by side with our teachers, they offer resources, they teach the teachers how to teach PBL, how to effectively communicate real world scenarios, how to effectively communicate how this applies in the real world. They help the teachers be better teachers. Aggie STEM has started an innovative STEM teacher boot camp in order to provide teachers with on the ground experience in STEM pedagogy. The purpose is to have them experience professors who teach high school students in a STEM approach so that they can see how it's done and they can use the professors as role models. Professors are often asked to come into schools and teach in their classrooms. The problem with doing that is that oftentimes the situation and the condition without knowing the students or building rapport doesn't result in a really good lesson. However, when they can come to Texas A&M and they're free from all other responsibilities that happen in their building, they can watch professors working with students who are there as part of the STEM summer camp and they're there for two weeks. So there's a good rapport between the professors and the students and the lessons can develop very naturally. Students benefit from being in the T-STEM Academy by, in most traditional schools, they're just learning the content, math, science, and other classes. At a T-STEM Academy, they're actually taking that knowledge and they're applying it to solve real world problems. It's made education a lot more enjoyable. Uh, a lot of times uh, students in and uh, the sciences and in the math uh, view it as uh, something that they just have to learn uh, the computations of math, be able to put it on a test and, and to make a grade. And what Aggie STEM has done, it's taken the concepts, the academic concepts, and given them real live scenarios to use it into uh, that they can see the benefit of learning that subject. I think one of the finest examples of the students being affected by STEM is our mechatronics program where we're trying to create multidisciplined engineering students who can swiftly switch between reality and model to solve multifaceted problems. They do these in competitions like FIRST Robotics, F1 in Schools, and FSE Autocross. Those programs, those competitions give the kids opportunities to use their skills and knowledge with regards to microelectronics, telecommunications, telemetry, and mechanical systems to provide the best possible solutions to the problems that they're presented with. When students work on PBLs, they do a lot more real world. They do a lot more critical thinking. They think outside the box, they look at the problem and find a solution. They're not just doing, well, A plus B equals C, but they're actually solving and thinking and understanding. Once they get to the state test, when they start taking either the STAR or the end of course, that's what the STAR is looking for. Well, the STAR test is a whole different level of testing where the students are actually having to utilize thinking skills, experimental skills, application skills, as opposed to just being able to answer a question for the right answer. If we didn't have Aggie STEM to help us create project-based learning opportunities for our students where they are actually learning, thinking, applying what they're learning in the classroom to real-world applications, they wouldn't do as well on STAR test. Aggie STEM has learned that schools that implement STEM project-based learning in a coherent and cohesive fashion have the highest student gains in math and science. Students who are below the mean and had been below the mean for a number of years have gotten above the mean and passed on the state minimum skills test. We offer a lot more real world scenarios and it's a lot more challenging and engaging and it keeps the students interested and motivated. You no longer just sit there and listen to a lecture on the board. Instead, you work and use what, you, what you're learning in a real world scenario like you would when you graduate and get a job. 